Okay, thanks, Pete. A spiritual sighting has been causing major traffic backups in one town. A man says he spotted the image of the Blessed Virgin Mary while driving by a church on Mineral Spring Avenue in North Providence, and people have flocked to the area ever since, hoping to get a glimpse. Eyewitness News reporter Mara Kennedy has more on the story from North Providence. People are still gathered and traffic is still backed up Friday night. We want to know if the Virgin Mary image is the real thing or a gimmick. So we talked to a religious professor to find out. Crowds sing in front of a North Providence church, hoping their words and prayers reach the ears of what they say is the Virgin Mary. This week, a man driving by the church at the presentation of the Blessed Virgin Mary tells a local newspaper that Mary herself, the mother of Jesus, presented herself to him on the church bell tower. But is this image really the Virgin Mother, or is it a trick to make people into believers? It's not so evident to me, but I can, I can see how people can see that in, in the image. So it's raining today and it's very humid. Do you yeah. think that plays a part in the image? Certainly. I mean, uh, it certainly could be natural reasons that explain the image, the formation of the image. But that wouldn't be the remarkable thing. The remarkable thing would not be scientifically how we could explain it, which we might very well be able to, but that it forms in the way that it does. As a professor of theology at Providence College, Paul Gondro is an expert at famous relics. He is also the father of the son who was recently kissed by the Pope in Rome, shown on Eyewitness News. So, as a career man and a believer, Gondro thinks the image is the real deal. Well, it, it all depends. Sometimes it's real, I believe. Sometimes it's not. Which is why the church will always do an investigation when something like this occurs. Gondro says the church would begin an investigation if people started saying the image was performing miracles. Until then, it seems like it's going to be a lot of songs, prayers, and blessings. The, the thing to stress here is, you know, in our we live in a culture which often wants to oppose science and religion or science and faith, and, and the Catholic tradition has never seen it that way, that the two need not be diametrically opposed, and that, and that there are many mysteries of the faith that can have a scientific explanation behind it. No comment from the pastor of the church or the bishop, so still no word on if there's going to be an investigation on the image. Reporting with the Mobile Newsroom, Mark Kennedy, Eyewitness News.